tons of Star Wars. They actually are pretty well stocked. They combine all the movies. Here we have the Lego. Crazy news for y'all. My mind is absolutely blown right now. It's like Shrek layers. Hey party people, so I just got to Costco and I am very excited because they've been having some crazy Lego deals here recently, like 25% off brand new sets. And I remember a year ago, like this wasn't happening. Like this was not like a normal thing to find at Costco. We have saved a ton of money recently by buying them at Costco, so. Yeah, we'll see what they have on the shelves today. Hopefully it's some newer stuff as well. Hopefully they've like rotated it out a little bit since last time I was here. And something I didn't realize actually until recently is that you can price match the sets from Costco. So like when I show these sets in videos and vlogs and showing them like at 25% off or like whatever price they're at, you can actually screenshot that or pause it and take a picture of it and then use it when you go to Target or Walmart or like any other stores that do price matches. So the more you know. Take advantage of these sales, y'all. Alrighty, let's head inside. Here's Costco, yay. All right, so I'm in now. I have to go find the Lego. Shouldn't be hard because they have a bunch of like Christmas stuff all around now. These look so fun. Like I almost want to get these and just like play with Ross and just shoot each other. I think that'd be kind of fun. I just found these really cute rugs and I really want to get one. A lot of these here are reminding me of that like red pickup truck Lego set because there's that one, this one that I think I'm gonna buy, and then this one here. That actually looks kind of fun. All right, so finally here we have the Lego. We have some Eternal sets and the Mandalorian Starfighter here for $49.99. And then moving down, we have Baby Yoda. We have like a bunch of Baby Yoda here. Actually, there's like a ton. And these are for $62.99. One more of Kylo Ren's shuttle for $99.99. And then finally, we have the Mario and Luigi starter courses. However, I don't see any Luigi right now, so maybe they're sold out, but either way, those are available for $44.99. The last time I was here was maybe two or three weeks ago and they had a lot more options back then. I'm wondering maybe like with the holidays coming up, they'll restock a bit more because they only have a few different sets here. Whereas they used to have like a ton of friend sets. They had the three in one castle, just a bunch more than there is right now. The advent calendars as well. So maybe they'll get more in stock at some point, but I'm not sure. They have these really cute little Disney, I guess like PJ type things. It's almost like a bathrobe, except it's a dress and I really want it. I also found this really cute K-Beauty facial skincare stuff. And I don't really know anything about skincare. I'm really bad at skincare, so I'm hoping this helps. And the box was really cute, so I had to. Alrighty, time to head out. Alrighty, quick update. I just loaded up my car, put my cart back. I'm leaving Costco. My foot hurts. All is good with the world. But I do actually have some crazy news for y'all. My mind is absolutely blown right now. Are y'all ready for this? This is wild. So as I was leaving Costco, I was like, you know, they have a lot of sets in stock. They've been rotating it a lot. Maybe they'll let me know what's coming next and how much it is. And guess what they did? One of the Costco employees inside literally just pulled up his computer screen and was like, here's everything we're getting soon. Here's the prices and here's what's being discontinued. We're not getting any more advent calendars and stuff like that. And I'm like, can I take a picture of this? And he was like, yeah, whatever, it's fine. He was like super nonchalant about it, but I was freaking out because it's like, this is huge, you know? Like I know for me and a lot of other people in this community, we like to buy sets on day one, right? But like, I'll hold off for a week or two or, you know, however long it is. If it's like more than four months then like maybe not, but I'll hold off for a small, reasonable amount of time to get 25% off a set. Like that's a no brainer. And now I know everything that is coming soon to Costco, which is crazy. Like this is huge. And I have all the info in my phone, so I can't like pull it up while recording, but some of them included like the Bugatti, like the Technic Bugatti, the Playscale at -AT from like 2020, I think it was. Some Ninjago sets, like the Water Dragon, I think was on the list. There's there's the $130 space shuttle coming soon. Like there's so much coming soon to Costco for really good prices. Like most of it's about like 20, 25% off, sometimes 30% if it's like not doing that great on the shelves. But the one thing he did say that was kind of like up in the air about all of it is that there's no real set delivery date for most of this stuff. There's been tons of shipping delays in the country. All the ports are backed up. And so they don't really know when they're getting a lot of this stuff. So I can't really like tell you guys that because they don't even know, which is absolutely crazy. But at least we do know what's coming, like what's on the way. And also apparently Lego is coming to Sam's Club. And I don't know if there's ever been Lego at Sam's Club before. I don't shop at Sam's Club, but like that's something new that they're doing. And so yeah, if you're a Sam's Club member, not a Costco member, you can take advantage of that. And also the most important thing is that because we don't have Costco all around the world, not everyone has a Costco membership, you can still take advantage of these deals. Like I vlog at Costco pretty regularly. You can screenshot any of it where it has like the set and the price. And I'm pretty sure that you can get it price matched because it's worked for other people. So 
keep all of that in mind very exciting things but anyways now it's time to head home because i have ice cream in the car and after talking this much it's probably melted hey party people what's going on so it's the same day but now it is nighttime and we're heading to target because i feel like it i don't know we were like in the area so now we're gonna see if there's any lego deals to see if they have that budget tumbler a lot of people have been looking for the the oh we call it the budget tumbler but I definitely like to see if it's in stock anywhere because it's been a pretty hot seller. So I found a ton of clothes. I made Ross carry it. Sorry, Ross. I'll live. But now we're checking out fall clothes for Ross because he likes sweaters. So the men's section always has the best t-shirts. I see my Pizza Planet shirt right now. If y'all were wondering where I got it. It looks so much more pristine than right now. It's like not even the same color. Oh my gosh, <laughs> it's so faded. Where are we going now, Ross? Lego aisle. Tons of Star Wars. Yeah. They actually are pretty well stocked. Yeah, what's First up? time I've actually seen a pro droid in person. Right? Yeah, I think oh, we shit. do have it. We haven't built it yet. Oh, wow. Actually, this is like the first time I've seen this one in stock, too. The Bad Batch shuttle. Bad Batch shuttle. That's going to be gone for Christmas. Oh, yeah. Remember? That'll be a great gift this year. No, 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 take a look. This is the last we'll see the Lego aisle look like. Right? This. Like, it's very full. It's a lot more full than I would expect. Also, we do have some sales, actually. The X-Wing is down $10 from oh, 50 nice. to 40 The Lego Star Wars TIE Fighter. These are on sale, but like not that great of a deal. Here we actually do have some empty shelves though. <laughs> like all of Speed Champions is gone, except for like 12 of this one set right here. Nothing else though. We have like some of the Creator 3-in-1s. That's about it. On the other side, the Marvel and DC section is pretty empty. And we still can't find that tumbler. I still have not seen that on shelves anywhere. The Lego store, Target, Walmart. So the 18 plus stuff are like more like adult sets. We have Adidas and it's kind of weird seeing it here. Like I feel like this is just something I would see at the Lego store. So it's kind of cool to see it at Target. And then over here as well, they have a bunch of the 18 plus sets, including the bookshop, which is kind of cool to see it at Target. They've had it for a while. Should we get Destiny's Bounty? I want the Jago movie version. Yeah, that one was cool. So here's the Halloween aisle. <laughs> it's empty. <laughs> we wanted to try to find some clearance Halloween stuff, but all they have is like Elsa from Frozen 2. They combine Halloween with Easter. What? What is happening? Why are they? What? <laughs> I don't get it. Oh, look at this. They have Fur Baby's first Christmas ornament. It's Ladybird's first Christmas this year. We need to get it. She's four. Try me. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> Frankenstein? Is it mint? Wait, it's just green colored cream? That's misleading. It's like Shrek. <laughs> yeah. It's got layers. You think she'd fit in the large? I don't know, man. She's like a really skinny but like long dog. She's a chonker. We already decided, Emily, warm it down. We're getting her a sweater. She needs a sweater. But does she need a medium or a large? She needs a large or an extra large. She's she's a big girl. All right, we'll go with the large then. Okay, are we going to get it? She is chonky. She's a chonky girl. Yeah, I think this will fit. I accidentally threw one of the balls over the fence when we were playing fetch, so I bought her four more. That's why he's dog mom. So I thought elastic girl was supposed to be like elastic but I don't think she is. Oh, she's only poseable. Man, I always forget that they have Lego over here. So they have the Mickey and Friends 4 Plus line. Is that already on sale? A oh, Disney Princess something? That's not actually the set that's on the shelf right there. They also have the Elsa's Ice Castle R2 and then the buildable Mickey and Minnie. There we go. Oh. What house are you, Ross? The Grand Army of the Republic. Alrighty, time to head out. Well, we got clothes for you. We got clothes for the dog. But we didn't get anything for me. Uh-uh. Is that okay? Yeah, I guess I'll live. 